fight broke out and they shot him. That was the news Darian Dozier woke up to Easter Sunday. He couldn't believe his friend, 23 year old Benny Heeslip, was dead, victim of a shooting in downtown Austin. Uh, it was pretty heartbroken. Uh, I've known Benny for quite a few years. I met him through his cousin. We were on the same track team. Candles, flowers, and notes sit on the corner of Trinity and East 11th. That's where Austin police say two groups of people got into a fight, then someone pulled a gun and fired. Officers performed CPR on the victim until paramedics arrived, taking him to the hospital. Dozier says his friend's death really set in when he was out shopping Sunday. He slipped worked at a shoe store in Round Rock. I, every time I pass by, I always see his face. So, you know, kind of passing by and not seeing him is kind of, this is reality now. The reality of a young life cut short, a friend he describes as humble and motivated. He was a workaholic. He's always working. Right now he had two jobs. So work was a big part of his life. As police continue looking for more answers, searching for the shooter and others involved, friends are left questioning how and why this had to happen. You know, all the chaos that does happen downtown during this time, this weekend, uh, it's kind of just a bad place, bad time. Police don't have much of a suspect description to go on. They're looking for three women and one man believed to be involved in the shooting. The four were last seen in a black four-door sedan driving east on East 11th Street towards I-35. David, back to you. Well, compared to other parts of downtown, that intersection is reasonably quiet. Now, we looked at crime stats from the area around 11th and Trinity from the past year. There were 27 thefts, 19 assaults, including two on a police officer. Those numbers may seem high, but just to the south of there, along 6th Street, there were more of all those crimes in the past month than in the past year around 11th and Trinity.